Sonic Holmes. <laughs> Awakening. Here we go. Absolutely. I need some fresh air. <laughs> yes, please go. I'll be right behind you with Arneson. Perhaps you can prepare the boat. There. That seems to have calmed Arneson enough to be carried. We'll follow you out. Ah, it's done doing we're so done with this chapter, so done to leave, leave finish in the game. And yeah, that's the worst to it. The chapter 7 will not continue in this episode. Free me festering soon and let me feel. Eyes without purpose, and now see the truth. Tear me mind from my flesh, scorn me festering soul. Phantoms of nothing, we are born to die. Filled in the eyes of our eldritch lord. Free my festering soul and let me feel. Oh, please, I wish to return. Free me, let me return. Free me and rejoice. Eyes without purpose, I now see the truth. Tear my mind from my flesh. Appreciate ya. Holmes, are you alright? Here, let me help. I'm fine. Holmes? Sherlock? What the hell were you doing? He almost killed you. I don't. You're right. Let's go, Watson. Oh, yeah. Time to get out of here. Bon Dieu! Still among the living! We are, though not for lack of trying by the sheriff. Well. He'd been telling people you died in the swamp, despite his trying to save you. <laughs> Crooked man. Through and through. Wait, is that Mr. Arneson? Yes, but he's not well. Do you know Lucy? Belle from the Nymph? That I do. Please bring her here. Mr. Arneson needs to see a familiar face if he's to have any chance of surviving. <sighs> Power of the heart. I get you. Wait here. Errol? Oh, Errol! Reckon we should give him space. Farewells are painful. No, 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 tell me that's not true. Watson, Mr. Arneson has endured a lot. Lost four fingers, a lot of blood, and some of his sanity. But with rest and tender care, he ought to survive those injuries, both physical and mental. <sighs> Thank you, Johnny. I'll take care of him. Thank you for bringing him home to me. We'll be all right. Are you quite certain? Do you have the space? The resources? I will stay with him at the mansion. It is not a burden to take care of your love. His property is in quite a state. It may not be the best place for recuperation. Hush now. Champagne will see it sorted. Then it's settled. Hear that, Errol? Us living under one roof. Careful what you wish for. Oh, and champagne? I'm about sick of watching that sheriff run riot through New Orleans. We ought to talk. Funny. I was just thinking that Grog did nothing to save your man. Together, I reckon you, me, and Arrow have the sway to make some changes around here. I like the sound of that. Holmes, our boat. Oh, we must make haste. Farewell all. Take care. Let's go, man. Nice, we did it. Sick. That cleared the chapter. Chapter 6, done. Finally, yo. Now, Chapter 7. Who's there? Hmm, who do you think? Let it be known that I'm handy with this revolver. Nonsense, Dr. Watson. As I understand it, when faced with the imperative to defend oneself, one's comrades, and one's nation, you fled. I... I... Aren't you going to introduce us, Sherlock? 
Watson, meet my brother Mycroft, the Queen's best boy. This is a grim augury indeed, for wherever Mycroft travels, tedium surely follows. In contrast, of course, to Sherlock, a man whose obsessive pursuit of the trivial tears through the most carefully laid plans like a hurricane. Yes, Do you have any idea uh, what you have disrupted? Did I? <laughs> your ego is inflated as much as your waistband. What word comes to mind? You... you work for the government? International trade is a delicate beast. Your antics and Edelweiss have jeopardized one of the Crown's richest relationships. Oh dear, as much as all the butter you've been slathering on your bread? We need your help. What? There is evil afoot. Strangeness and savagery like I have never seen. Something otherworldly festering in the dark beyond our reach. We have seen things that defy explanation. Mystic forces, magic. You must help us. It's true. The British government does not invest its resources in the insane or intoxicated. Pull yourself together. I know men like you. Men like you grease palms, whisper in ears, start wars, and you send men like me to die in them. You and the rest of your corpulent cronies. Ha! Corpulent! That was it. Interesting, Sherlock. But as you again drift away from sanity, you find yourself another John. All right, so the choice is made. I beg your pardon? There is only us. We cannot run from this problem. I shall take the book and Davis' cryptic message to Barnes. See what he makes of it. Hmm. Hmm? Interesting. What is your Barnes can do that pretty much? Alright, here we go. There's nothing to investigate, I'm just messing about. As you were, Watson. Do what you must. Uh, let's look around. There's Watson now, so that's quite interesting. No. Another sinking near Scotland. By the strand for the details. Cool. Thank you, sir. Get the strand. Get the true facts. Did. They get the true facts, and the true facts are on their good. Look for Barnes, okay. So Barnes was at the other place. Get a Barnes, okay. I know what it is. And it's weird. To be Can you satisfy my curiosity? Sorry, sir, I can't help you. Thanks, Watson. You know, entire game we're playing Sherlock, and you know, now plays Watson. It's kind of a. Yeah, it has been a while, Barnes. You know, Doctor Watson. Indeed, it has, and good to see you as always. Uh, how can I help? Last time we met, you mentioned your knack for translating occult texts. I was wondering if you could help me with this book. Certainly, I... Goodness. Where on earth did you procure this grimoire? That's a long story. What do you make of it? It seems to describe pagan rituals, ancient deities... I can try and... Um, just the pages bearing that symbol. Entity of ocean? Oh, if you can... Barnes. Uh, interesting man. I take it his literary pursuits are somewhat of a deviation from the family business. What makes you say that? He wrote a poem. Let me see if... Say not of me that weekly... Mm. I have a... Please. Much obliged. Oh. Oh, 
see. For some reason, it makes my skin crawl. Huh. Take care of your master. A moment, please. Spellbinding pages. Get out of this place. Doctor, nice to see you after all this time. A flower? This feels so strange. Like, playing as a, you know, this character. All right, we've got so. Okay. Achievement. So let's do. Hmm. Aspiration. Oh, that's wrong. <laughs> Yet again. So let's go with. Okay. Do you know anything about this? I don't think anyone here knows the answer. You should ask someone else. I could look it up. Let's do that in. Quick before I waste time. You know, because I will. It's point. I see we got
Mm. Yeah. Like OP message. Ha! So let's go. <laughs> so. I was wrong on that one. Yep. Our title. Okay, achievement. I made no sense, so it's no skin. Okay, so it's okay. Inspirational. Did that. Did that. No, I know that. What's the title? Oh, title was eighty seven. Matt. Yeah, 87. Oh no, it's got its location. Oh, there we go, I did it. Not too difficult. Sick. Uh, that video was sold. Oh.
we'll get that. Say, do you possess coastal maps of Scotland? Indeed. Have you figured out what the Stevensons are known for? Feats of lighthouse engineering. You have my thanks for the book. My pleasure, Doctor. Do you need any particular part of the coast? Loch Harbour, west coast. Right then. I'll unroll it on the desk. Okay. All yours. In the meantime, I will attend to my translation. Much appreciated. Ah, uh, cool. Get out of and let's go. May I ask for your assistance? No, I don't know anything about that. Okay, I'm going to watch uh, Let's go. <laughs> All right. Let's go over there for us. Nearly done, Doctor. Have you found the book you're after? That. That's goodness. That's what I was coming for. Doctor, look what I just found. Barnes, have you finished with the book? Yes. I've written out a translation of the section you wanted. It, uh, 
puts the Grim in Grimoire. I thought as much. Long story short, it details macabre rituals, death, leviathans and the apocalypse. See for yourself. I must ask you to leave the book with me so I can read more of it. It's compelling. Very compelling. You have been of great help, so yes. Excellent. I could barely put it down. Farewell. Nice. Okay. Leave Florence and Bookshop, okay? Mycroft, here to buy a book on fraternal dysfunction? The Holmes family is beyond counselling, Doctor. True? More deserving of scientific study. What do you want? I came to warn you. Perhaps you have a moment to... Sorry, I reserve Tuesday afternoons for time with friends. I'm worried about Sherlock. He's not well. You should know that he has had episodes in the past. Detachment from reality. He will need your support. Such gall. First you crush him under your boot heel, now you ask me to pick up the pieces! <laughs> your emotions are impeding your rationality. He needs to be distracted, diverted into something less harmful. Surely you jest. Only one thing shall truly bring him peace of mind, and that is solving his case. The last case he pursued so doggedly was Cordona. He came home a wreck, and this time I fear he may not return at all. You are not his father, Mycroft. Not anymore. He is a grown man, a brilliant man. I know you care for him. I just wish you also respected him. The crown cannot help you. But I can. Give him this. What is it? A confidential note tied to his case. He may see value in it. Just do not tell him it came from me. Oh, speaking of the crown, perhaps you can help us with another matter? It requires some local knowledge. I'm all ears. For your eyes only. Here is a folder with all the details. Okay, new case. Cool. Alright, let's see. About this. I don't think anyone here knows the answer. I should ask someone else. Well, what's fun is I'm going to leave this episode here and I'll catch you in the next one. For a lot of fun, and we're so near to the game.